Yeah. Marry my son. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, don't see I tell you I'm a medical student. Yeah. And you say, what are you trying to be then? A nurse? Yeah, all the time. Nursing Explain the logic study, to me. Nursing. nursing. That's how you know what's wrong with you. That's not common knowledge. No, it's not. It's not. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we're going to be talking about our experiences in medical school um, and as you can see we are all melanated females so we will be talking Ow. from um, <laughs> our perspective. Oh guys introduce yourself. Uh, so hey guys, uh, my name is Jessica and I'm in my fifth year of med school. Hey everyone, my name is Lucrece and I'm in my fourth year of med school. Hey guys, I'm Khadija and I'm in my fifth year of medicine. And hey guys, my name is Jan and I am in my third year of medicine. Alright, cool. I'm going to ask some like, some couple couple quick questions, yeah? Mm -hmm. So, just let me know. Um, we kind of touched upon this, but have you ever experienced imposter syndrome? Imposter syndrome. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And that's come in the form of... Everybody else is really smart here, and yeah. I don't know what the hell is going on. Why am I in the room? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe medicine wasn't for me. <laughs> I say this every day, and I'm like, I don't think I'm supposed to be here right now. <laughs> but yeah. But say for me, sometimes I'm made to feel invisible. Mm. You'll be like, okay, you're you're giving the eye contact and the attention to the student, mm. white students. However, you don't want to look at me, you don't want to mm. talk to me. I've had that before. Okay. Yeah, that's what I mean. Mm. Mm, so other people can actually give you that imposter syndrome. Yeah. Where you have to reject it and give it oh, back yeah. to them. Reject it. That is not the right. You said that. That's your problem. Flowing off that, I guess, as well, have you, what's your take on institutional racism and have you experienced it? Um, so institutionalized racism what that means is experiencing racism and it might not be directly it might be yeah, indirectly mm -hmm. due to the systems in place and it is present it is a fact it's present in education unfortunately healthcare mm -hmm. um you know everywhere every, yeah. everywhere has <laughs> it uh, so oh sorry now mm -hmm. just in one that i can't prove i can't necessarily prove it but you know <laughs> mm. what was you gonna say just um one person, you can cut this out if you believe that it needs to be cut out, cut it out, but they never cut this person out of uni, so... Um, <laughs> <laughs> they said, um, why is she always bringing up race? And I don't, I don't bring up race because I don't want to talk to people about race. Why is she always bringing up race? This is why the right wing say F all black people. Oh, I, I said that! I told the head of year, um... And they said that they were going to take it very seriously. That uh, that's what they uh, say. Uh, and then I was in that same thing. group with that person <sighs> in the uh, end of the year, so they don't take nothing seriously. <sighs> yeah, that is. <sighs> and that's institutionalized racism that you can um, be affected. And then when you go to a meeting of the head of year, then they're just probably gaslighting you further. Mm. Um, and then they say that something's going to happen, but this you just go to the status quo, and your feelings are just. Uh, as black women, our feelings are never really valid, are rarely validated. Mm. Yeah, just disregarded, really. Yeah. Mm. As if to say we don't have emotions. Mm. The only well, that's emotion the is anger, apparently. Mm. The tears that cry, that mm. I will cry, will never have the same impact as the tears someone else will cry. Hey. Yeah. yeah, let somebody else be um, crying the same tears that you're crying. And see what they get. <laughs> <laughs> Me, same tears. Oh, sorry. Sorry, do you think sorry? No, even even sorry. the sorry should have sorry screen. No, 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 no. They'll say she was, she was crying angrily. <laughs> no, no, you should have been crying angrily. Yeah. I've never seen that one before. <laughs> 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 Whoa! <laughs> That's the real tea. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys. So on a lighter note, yeah. <laughs> Just the mood in here. Um, what is people's first reactions normally when you tell them you're a medical student? It depends on who. So, most of the time it's Just positive. Like I say, it's positive. Yeah. Like if you say to family uh, at weddings and family members yeah, and love like that, they're just yeah. like, yeah. marry my son. Yeah. <laughs> yes. no, you want, you yes. want my son? Okay. Yes. She's a doctor. Come and speak to her. One person said, marry my son. And then I said, oh, what does your son do? And this was a long time ago. <laughs> uh, what does your son do? And um, he said, he works in JD. Nothing against JD, yeah, but yeah, one of us against me on that. One of us, one of us, me on that. Mm. Mm. Can, 
one woman I went and was like, yeah, I'm gonna get your number off your uncle, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna talk, we're gonna talk. Okay, let's see. <laughs> um, You're not cupid. I think people around me that I would say that I know or like, I'm saying network sort of things mm-hmm. like, I guess to the cool black people and whatnot. Um, they're surprised in a good way. They don't um, expect me, I guess, to have the brains to be the medicine. But I, I love that reaction because I'm like, hmm, I do medicine. They're like, whoa, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Um, and then there's the other reaction you get when you're on the ward and you specifically told the patient I'm a medical student and they, they go oh okay and they stop they go quite fast <laughs> 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 and then they go oh so what you finish that it's a midwife or nurse oh I hate that oh, I didn't know you were going to say that because yes, <laughs> yes, yes I, I didn't actually clock yeah there's always that five second yes. pause yeah. where they have to comprehend and then they still say midwife still or nurse the, I didn't tell you midwife, midwifery, yeah. I didn't tell you nursing, I said medical student. No, I no, get I confused. Pharmacies. I get confused. Yeah, I've got pharmacies yeah. as well. Before. I get confused. We're doing pharmacy. Yeah. I tell you I'm a medical student. Yeah. And you say, what are you trying to be then? A nurse? Yeah, all the time. Nurses Explain the logic to me. Nursing. nursing. That's how you know midwife does <laughs> midwifery. <laughs> <laughs> Medicine does doctor. <laughs> No, it's not. No, you know, I, I don't know if it's that common knowledge. Sometimes I feel like it's what you know, look or like. It's yeah. assumption yeah, that yeah. one, most nurses are, you know, are black women, black so females. they That's expect That's black it. females to be doctors. And I was talking to just about this earlier. I was shadowing one of uh, the junior doctors on the ward mm. in my last placement, and she was talking about how when she's on the ward, like patients will try to get her attention, calling her the nurse. Like they'll be like, "Excuse me, nurse, nurse, nurse." This time she's in her own clothes, so she's not the nurse. Is it? <laughs> Five years of my studies used to call me nurse. No, 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 don't get me wrong. <laughs> I love nurses, nurses with anyone on the yeah, board. Nobody in the comments. Yeah. They teach <laughs> me. They teach me better than any oh, doctor yeah, has ever taught me. So nice. Lucrece, everyone knows she goes to find the nurses. They will teach me. But what I don't like is the fact that you're making an assumption simply because of my colour. Mm. Wow. So that's a thing. Yeah. Um, yeah. Any black girls um, looking to get into medicine? Yeah. Get ready for that. <laughs> okay. So that's people's reactions. And how do your like your family? Oh, let's God. just say like home family feel about you studying mm. medicine like. Obviously, like the bed. Are they proud of you? Do they acknowledge? I don't know, like your achievements in the home. Do you feel appreciated for you know the greatness that's within you? This is deep. <laughs> Everybody has forgotten my first name now. So my yeah. name is Doctor. Okay. Doctor. 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 It will be like okay, I'll get a random phone call from my aunt. <laughs> so I have to spread. I've actually heard it before. But yeah, so it's it's nice. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I've got an older cousin, whenever he comes, I, he's actually, like Khadija said, he's mm-hmm. forgotten my name. Doctor, you're right. And I'm like, I look at him like, you know, I'm not there yet. <laughs> Just say it. I mean, I am going to get there, but I'm not there yet. Yeah. Um, and I guess it scares me a little bit. I don't know about you guys, but, mm-hmm. you know, being called doctor and it's like, they, all, all of a sudden they expect you to know these things. I'm like, please, mm-hmm. don't ask me what's wrong with you because I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Um, okay, just the last point where I just wanted to ask you guys. Um, obviously, like you know, we were born in this country, but this is not where you know our heritage is. So, do you have any kind of plans of like taking uh, your your skills back home to give back to the motherland? Most definitely. Yes. Oh yes. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> Y'all already know. <laughs> mm. I just realized we were all like four different African girls. Different yeah, people. oh my gosh, guys, say where you're from. Uh, I'm from the Demo- Democratic Republic of Congo. Ooh, Ooh, Congo. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Um, I'm from Ghana. So hey. I'm an Ashanti queen. Ashanti. Oh, 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 um, me, like Dan, I'm a young East African girl. Um, I'm from Tanzania. <laughs> Obviously, I'm from Uganda. Mm. The Pearl of Africa, just saying. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's, cool, right. it's not just what we call ourselves. That's what we are. Okay. okay. All right. Big up Uganda. Um, cool. So that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have yes. watched this far, do you guys want to say any like last minute take home messages before we close? Y'all all queens. And kings, if you're watching this, yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. Um, and recognize your worth, honestly. Yes. Yeah. Self esteem is 
will take you so far when mm -hmm. you recognize your own worth so mm -hmm. yeah i would say that medicine is hard but it's fun mm -hmm. um it requires stamina and just stick mental type <laughs> stick yeah mental strength um just stick at it because it will pay off yeah just going off of what jessica said um as we said balance is very important so keeping on top of your studies but also maintaining your friendships family uh -huh. faith um, yes. all very important yeah faith well that's the thing i was going to talk about mainly like um first of all like it's not easy getting into medical school mm -hmm. so like if you don't get in like don't let that throw you yeah, off don't give up. like stay strong pray and just look at what you need to work on within yourself um to kind of get yourself there sometimes you may have to take the long route and that's okay as well it's like it's not a race like it's it's a marathon life is a marathon mm -hmm. and at the end of the day um <clears throat> god has a plan for each and every one of us and once you're in med school as well um i found when i was in 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 um uni that's when my faith kind of grew stronger because that's when life really started challenging us like, <laughs> <laughs> this is <laughs> Then Mary Jane Black. That is true. Yeah, so faith is such an important part of who I am personally, and I I would recommend it to you all. To Pasta. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for watching the video. Love you guys as always. Give this video a thumbs up if you thought it was helpful. Do you want us back? Tell us. Hi. Yeah. Let me know if you want to see these beautiful faces back again. We can bring them back, talk about whatever you all want. Like, comment down below what you've learned from this video. If you have any extra tips, if anything that you're going through, like, you know, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. And of course, follow these lovely girls on their socials um, on Instagram. Everyone's going to be in the description box below. Love you guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.